Hello, my name is Dr. Johnny Thomas, Superintendent of Rich Township High School District 227. Thank you for watching our weekly update. I'm coming to you today to provide important information about the district's plan to transition from remote instruction to our hybrid model, fall testing, and more. As we previously communicated, we are planning for our students to return to campus for in-person instruction following our hybrid model beginning November 16th. In the hybrid model, students will engage in synchronous instruction both in-person and remotely. This model will reserve 100% of the student body with approximately 50% of the students attending in school, while 50% of the students will engage in instruction remotely. Students will participate in in-person instruction according to an alternate A week, B week schedule. In-person instruction will occur Mondays through Thursdays at both campuses and campuses will be closed on Fridays to allow for deep cleaning. Some groups of students will be identified for priority in-person instruction and will attend school every week, and we encourage those students to do so. Additionally, students who are immunocompromised or have family members who are immunocompromised will still have the option to participate in remote learning. For more information on our transition to hybrid learning, please be sure to check this week's email message to our families. All school testing for the fall will occur during the month of October. Freshmen will take the PSAT 8-9 on October 20th and 22nd. Sophomores and juniors will take the PSAT NMSQT on October 14th and 29th. And current seniors must take the SAT on October 14th and 27th as a graduation requirement. Students will be expected to be on campus to take the assessment and transportation will be provided if necessary. Please check your email for a detailed testing schedule that is separated by grade level and last name. The district will offer the PSAT 8-9 placement test to all of our feeder school 8th grade students on Saturday, October 17th and Saturday, October 24th from 8.30 a.m. to noon. Students will be tested on reading and writing and math skills, and the assessment will take approximately two and a half hours with additional time provided for scheduled breaks. More information regarding the assessment can be found on the College Board's website at collegeboard.org. The deadline to register for this test is October 7th, so please check your emails to sign up. Our seniors are preparing for the Scholastic Achievement Test also known as the SAT. We are proud to announce two virtual boot camps for Rich Township students. The verbal boot camp, which works on a learner's reading, reasoning, and writing skills, will take place on Saturday, October 3rd. And the math boot camp will take place on Saturday, October 10th. Both boot camps start at 9 a.m. and end at 11 a.m. All seniors are expected to participate. Please check your email for the link to attend these sessions. The district will host a virtual parent-teacher conferences Thursday, October 15th and Friday, October 16th. The link to sign up for your appointment will be made available next week. Finally, curbside meal distribution will continue in October at both the STEM and Fine Arts and Communication campuses. As a reminder, families do not have to live in the community or attend district schools to participate in this program. Parents can pick up meals without their children being present. There are no forms to fill out and no income requirements. Five days worth of meals will be provided. Next week, meals will be served Monday and Wednesdays from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. and Monday evening from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. The next scheduled date for meal pickup is Monday, October 5th. Our community is stronger when we work together. Thank you for supporting us as we strive to reach high scholastic goals for our students. I encourage you to visit our website for real-time updates regarding testing, hybrid learning, and more. As always, make sure you stay connected with us on social media, our website, and continue to check your emails regularly for updates. Your support is truly appreciated. Please, as always,
stay safe, stay healthy, stay connected, and always look after each other. Thank you.